Hey everybody, it's Dustin again with the WebEx Devices team. And today we're just going to give a, a little preview of a, of a new feature we've got coming out uh, in relation to uh, macros and uh, using action panel buttons on your Touch 10 or your Navigator. So we've done a lot of videos on these and talking about the power of the macro engine, the ability to create some custom icons and, and uh, to do great things and interact with your device from the Touch device. Um, but one of the things that we've uh, not been able to do until now is um, you've been pretty much stuck with the current um, list of icons or uh, colors and features that are available that are listed in the uh, macro UI extension editor. So what we're going to show you today and what I'm excited to talk about is the ability to upload custom images um, to basically be the icons for your touch devices, including the Touch 10. So let's go ahead and do a quick demo and show you how this is going to work. So I've got my uh, interface here of my WebEx board. Now, I'm showing this on a board, but I do have a Touch 10 um, attached to this as well as a navigator. But over here in the upper right-hand corner, you'll see I've got my uh, Cisco Telepresence Touch. This is just a Touch 10 that I have attached to this board. So we're going to demo um, how this is going to work and show you that it's actually working on a Touch 10. Um, but what I'm going to do here is go to my UI Extensions Editor. And for sake of this demo, I'm just going to create a UI extension. Now, I could make these extensions you know, work with, uh, obviously, macros. We're not going to go into that today because we're just going to show um, how these buttons can be created and um, how they can uh, have the, the icons changed. So I'm just going to create one here. And what I'm going to do is create an action button. Now, on this action button, um, I, I'm going to leave the ID, ID the same here. And I'm actually just going to say for the example here is, one of the things we've talked about is um, you know, the ability to have like a, uh, a custom join button maybe for the IVR of your uh, Microsoft Teams uh, meeting using the uh, video integration for Microsoft Teams or CVI through Cisco. So um, this could be like a, a shortcut button maybe for Microsoft Teams to either prompt for a meeting number uh, for a manual join or it could be to take you straight into your IVR. So I'm going to use that as my example and I'm just going to say here MS Teams as the name of that button. So I'm only going to make this one, you know, available out of call because I wouldn't be joining a meeting if I'm in a call. Um, but what I'm going to do here is, is typically we would, you know, like choose the purple color because it's kind of the Microsoft Teams color. And I used to like to do the, uh, the camera icon here, very similar to our call button like you see over here. Um, but what I'm going to do now is you'll see there's this new um, upload icon button that's available for you. So I'm going to select that and I'm going to browse. And I actually have got just a Teams logo uh, set here. And I'm going to upload that. And you'll see that I now have this custom icon, which I have the ability to replace, that is available for this action button. And I'm going to go ahead and push this to my device. OK. You'll look over here on my Touch 10. Uh, you'll see that I now have this MS Teams action button. And you'll notice that it now has that logo. Whoops, just went to sleep on me. So now we have that logo kind of allowing me to customize or do uh, something more specific rather than the ones that I have built in um, for uh, my action button. So really quick video here, just kind of want to show this. Uh, I know that a lot of people are going to be very excited about this. Um, we can go into more details on this and show you how um, this would actually uh, you know, be done inside of the, uh, the XML for this UI extension. But, uh, really just kind of wanted to give this highlight, let everybody know that this is coming, um, and that if you're in an EFT right now, you'll be able to play with this today. But I uh, hope you like it. Um, if you've got any questions, please comment below, and uh, we'll see you next time.